Alright, another edition of What the Fuck, Captain's YouTube Atheist Community and Stickam Fun. Okay. Really wasn't much fun. <laughs> no, Stickam was okay last night. A little weird hacker guy got in early and uh, booted everybody out of the room, and so we kind of made a mess, and I don't know. Uh, Karina was there for a while, but she had to go to work, and I don't know. Conversation was kind of thin, and uh, a little bit funny later, talking about comets, blowing up the world, kind of stuff was fun. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I don't know, weird night, but it was, it was okay-ish. Yeah, it was okay. Uh, there was people there. Uh, let's see, who was there? I think Nuclear Knight was there, I think she was. Yeah, she had a cold or something, maybe something, I don't know. Uh, and, uh, um, Antique Lenses was there, but she didn't, she had a cold or something, wasn't on camera. And, uh, that jazz girl showed up, though, so that was really good. <laughs> she, and she looked pretty spectacular. Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, and there was somebody else. <laughs> Zombie wasn't there, which is kind of weird. Um, zombies are full of formaldehyde. Yeah. Took a week off. Um, she might have said something about that. I'm not sure. I don't know. But anyway, um, didn't see her anyway. Uh, what else is news? Yeah, I don't know. You know, there was people and such, and it was conversation, sort of, kind of. So, it wasn't as bad as the two weeks ago. No, it wasn't as bad as last week, but it wasn't nearly as good as two weeks ago. Yeah, two weeks ago was good. Something like that, anyway. But anyway, um, yeah, the worst part was, though, you know, I, I left a little bit early, around 6.30 in the morning, and then, you know, ten minutes after I got off a of stick cam, I got a telephone call. So the furnace wasn't working in one of the cottages here. And so I had to fight with that. But the really funny part was, is, you know, the whole motor on the fan that blows the air was shot, and I, you know, I keep old junk, you know, and I happen to have an extra, I had a spare one, you know, that pulled out of somewhere, I don't know from where, and it actually worked, so that was pretty amazing, so that saved a lot of trouble, so, it took to, you know, instead of a turning into old day project, it was just an hour, so it wasn't too bad, um, and just happened to barely fit, and it was just, yeah, I just really, it was just one of those lucky things, everything just lucked out. So, it was just good. Um, but, you know, I was really, really tired. So, now I'm really, really, really tired because I didn't get enough sleep because I had to do that shit. Um, so, anyway, enough, ex you know, that's just personal crap. Fuck that crap. To business. All right. Um, in the atheist community, I don't know. I didn't watch a lot of videos again. Uh, Coughlin made one on the education thing. and I uh, yeah, didn't like his too much. Uh, you know, regarding the Thunderfoot response to some guy I'd never even watched before. And, uh... So anyway, you know, and I did my whatever into the whole thing. And yeah, it all kind of gets kind of personal, and, and there's a lot of rubbish in people's arguments. And, uh, you know, but there are arguments there. You know, I mean, it's like, you know, people can complain about that stuff. It's kind of lame. Just because you can see past the occasional asshole remark, and um, there's substance to the argument. It's like the whole rape debate. There's been a lot of good arguments in amongst all the ad hominem kind of bullshit. So anyway, um, speaking of that, yeah, I have to make another video response to that conference report guy. He's, he's still kind of saying that uh, somehow we're all mass murderers inside, like we're all Adolf Hitler, <laughs> just waiting to get out, and all we need is the right circumstance and we'll Hitler. And I, I, I just think that's a pile of shit. Um, you either have a disposition that makes you capable of certain things or you don't. I mean, you have to, it's like, you know, it's like I couldn't be a beef eater even if I wanted to now. It's not even a moral dilemma anymore. I, I just, I can't, I can't stomach beef. I can't eat it without making it making me sick. So, you know, there's no moral dilemma for me. You know, there's no, I have no doubt, you know, that, um, you know, I'm not going to, I mean, I, I know what my disposition is, and it's just silly for somebody to say, no, oh, no, I know that you're capable of doing that. No, you don't know shit. I know me. I know what I'm capable of. And I think it's just bullshit to say we're all the same kind of asshole. No, we're very different kinds of asshole. We have very different sensibilities, desires, drives, that we have a different nature, and then we have a different intellectual understanding. And... Um, some of us would find it would find the disgrace of doing something we believe to be wrong um, the humiliation of it the internal humiliation 
to be something they wouldn't, you know, it's like an honor thing. They'll do the Harry Carey thing, you know, before you'll dishonor. And, and there's, there's people that have character. And I think it's just bullshit to say they don't. That, you know, somehow you're going you're gonna to undo their character with some kind of circumstantial um, thing. Well, of course there's circumstances where people have to make trade-offs, but it doesn't change the fact that they either have character or they don't have character. So, but whatever, I don't, I'm don't. i making the video now, and I don't want to make the video now. But I'm just saying, I, you know, I, I hate to call bullshit on him again, but I just his argument is bullshit. So, whatever. Um, so there's that whole debate, and then there's that other debate with the Amazing Atheist thing, you know, when Jama Flipper did his response video to TJ, and TJ didn't accept it as a response video. That's sort of bogus, too. I mean, Thunderfoot doesn't accept my response videos either, so I don't bother even trying to respond to him personally. Um, so, you know, whatever, people have that prerogative. So, what else is there? I mean, I, but I guess you really shouldn't engage in a debate with somebody unless you're going to unblock them for the purpose of the debate anyway. Um, yeah, so let's see, there's got to be some other subjects going around. Uh, so like the Chad guy, he made a video about just the whole, what's featured on YouTube and just the, the whole priorities of our fail culture kind of thing, so it's pretty good. Um, yeah, yeah, otherwise, I just, I mean, I haven't just, I haven't, you know, I haven't, haven't watched a whole lot of videos. I mean, I've watched a lot, but I guess they're just not the right ones. I mean, they're just not ones I have anything to say about. Or maybe I'm just really tired. Yeah, that's probably it. So, um, yeah, I was losing subscribers pretty quickly, and then uh, all of a sudden I picked up a picked up a bunch by not being uh, yeah, I guess it was because I was in Stickham or something maybe I get subscribers that way but I finally hit 4,500 subscribers on the In Mendham channel but there's no point in mentioning it because as soon as I mention it I'll drop below 4,500 so there's no point but anyway it doesn't matter um, I mean it's not 4,500 isn't a milestone kind of number I just have this fear that I'm never going to get to 5,000 so I guess I have to celebrate 4,500 uh, but anyway uh that's all. Uh, Karina did a Oscar review video, but she didn't see any movies. <laughs> but that's the kind of review I do, so it was okay. Um, a couple of them, anyway. Um, yeah, I don't know. That's, that's all, folks, I guess. Yeah, that's all. It's enough, right? Yeah, it's enough. So, shall it be um, the next time I make a video? Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what I'm doing right now. Uh, i got to go to sleep. Sorry, this really wasn't uh, this wasn't a sufficient video. Um, but the only happens, you know, periods videos just aren't really up to sufficiency snuff. Oh, sorry, <laughs> yeah, I was supposed to leave. I'll do it now for real. My hair's all fucked up too. <laughs> I don't know what the hell's going on. I had a great hair day the other day. And and all fell apart again.